This is problem number 48 of the Stewart Calculus 8th edition, section 2.5. Let f of x equal 1 over x and g of x equal 1 over x squared. Part A. Find f of g of x. And if you recall, this is the same as the function g plugged into the function of f. That's what this notation means. So we will do just that for part A f of g would be 1 divided by, and since the function has an x here in the denominator, this new function g will go where the x is for the function f, and therefore it would be 1 over x squared in the denominator. And if we rearrange this, 1 divided by this is the same as 1 divided by, or 1 multiplied by the reciprocal. In a much simpler sense, the final function is x squared. And that is what this is equal to f of g, the composite function. Part p is f of g continuous everywhere explain. Now, if we take a look at f of g, the function is x squared. It's a polynomial, and we're tempted to say that the function is continuous everywhere for that reason. However, this is a composite function of two different functions, both of which uh, did not have x in their domain. So because that's how they started out, there's this, there was a discontinuity for each function at x equals 0, then we say that f of g is also uh, not, also has uh, a discontinuity at discontinuity at x equals to 0. So it is not continuous everywhere. 